Yeah, I'm wearing a Wonder Woman shirt. Can we, like, not talk about that fact? Let's get this video started. Hey guys, welcome back to Wednesdays on Fashionably Late. This week is summer week, and I decided to do things to do when you're bored in summer. This is a very relatable topic, so I hope this can help somebody out there who's bored. I changed my background a little bit. Um, I'm in a different place, so I had to like improvise. Let me know if you like this better or you like the background of my bedroom better. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up and make sure you subscribe to be notified every single day. So without further ado, let's just get on with the video. The first thing I think you should do is try DIYs. Whether they're stupid, silly, you think they won't work, just try them. Number two is to read a book. I know most of you guys are like, it's summer, really reading? I understand that, I'm there, I'm with you guys, I feel that spiritual connection with you guys, but reading actually is a lot of fun once you get into it. Number three is to watch YouTube videos because it takes up a lot of time. It's really fun. Like, you lose yourself in it. Number four is to babysit. Number five is to watch people's dogs. Number six is to walk dogs. Number seven is to clean because you might not think so, but cleaning is actually, like, really calming. Number eight is to rearrange because... Um, rearranging your room is very fun and time consuming. Number nine is to throw a party. Number 10 is to attend a party if you cannot throw one. Number 11 is to have a super cool sleepover. Number 12 is to pull an all-nighter. Number 13 is to pick up a new TV show. Number 14 is to karaoke and you don't have to do this in public. You can do this in your room, by yourself. I know we all do it. Please don't try to deny that because I'll start calling you a liar. Number 15 is to learn something new, whether it's a new subject or a new hobby or a new skill. It's really just something that helps you work towards something. Number 16 is to cook. Number 17 is to create a drive-in movie. And literally all you need for this is an iPad or a phone um netflix or hulu or something like that or even the disney channel app whatever you want to watch um downloaded movie on your phone ipad computer something like that and a car with some pillows blankets and snacks number 18 is to have a family movie night number 19 is to go on a hike number 20 is to write a short story number 21 is to write letters Number 22 is to stargaze. Number 23 is to try a new food you've never tried before. Number 24 is make the world a better place. Number 25 is to play night games like manhunt. Number 26 is to make popsicles. It's so much fun, you guys. Number 27 is to have a pajama day. Just lounge around in your pajamas. I'm sure you probably do that. Number 28 is to have a picnic. Number 29 is to have a at-home spa day. 30, I know we all do this. I know we do it. Don't lie. It's same with karaoke. I know we all do this. We all turn on our favorite jams and we all dance till the sun comes up. But this is more of a step further than just dancing. Make up a dance. Dissipates. Is that the right word? Dissipates? Dissipates? Thank you so much for watching today's video. Check out yesterday's video by clicking the link at the end of this video and make sure you come back tomorrow for Thursday's video. Comment down future themes. Make sure you subscribe and make sure you give this video a big ol' thumbs up. Make sure you comment down future video themes you'd like to see in the future. And I'll see you guys next Wednesday. Bye.